Hi everyone, welcome to another episode of Kevin Plays Lotro. Today we're continuing on with the Zoruka Allegiance quest. And before we start that, I would like to invite you guys all, if you happen to like the video, please feel free to hit that like, subscribe, bell notification. And if you're already a subscriber, thank you so much. I greatly appreciate it. Alright, let's do it. Let's continue on. Let's see I must here. Speak with you. Chapter 4, Friends of the Longbeards. Floricita, I must speak with you. There are rumors in the hall that a group of Longbeard explorers has gone missing while excavating a perilous cavern. Apparently, one of the old tunnels gave way and the dwarves did not return. I believe they might be trapped, but still alive. We must, must reach them and assist the Longbeards. Of course, we will do that. Alright, here we go. We must hurry. Yes, this is what I was hoping for. More missions and more instances within the quest itself. Okay, that's what I... Good. Okay, quickly now. We must hurry. If they remain alive, these long birds may not have much longer twist raging. Monsters in this mission will enrage at low morale, gaining attack strength and attack speed. Well, that will avail them not, because Floricita will kick their booty. All right. Rescue these guys and clear fallen rocks. Alrighty. Where are we at? Pit of Stone Jaws. Okay. Is there a map? No. Oh, here I am, right here. So, I guess I go straight this way to. I don't know, we'll try that way. Careful, hobgoblins and wargs are already investigating the recent cave in. Well. Let's see if I could take them all. Hello. Hello. Hello and hello. Alrighty. Come on, everyone. Come down into a group. Yes. Yay! Alright. Look at that. Alright. Yeah, careful. I'm Floricita. I'm overpowered. I got, uh... Higher quest armor than the normal quest ar armor and all that stuff. Yay! Alright. Yes, now some of you guys might be thinking if I want a challenge, why don't I just run naked through here? Well, because I don't want a challenge. <laughs> Come on, come on. There we go. Because when these guys hit me, I'll go, ow. Ow. Okay, let's get rid of these fallen rocks. Anyway, because I'm a casual gamer, that's why. I don't really need to go hardcore. And let's see here. Yay! Poor long beard. There we go. All right. Let's go. Okay, so they're behind the rocks, right? Okay. So clear the rocks and rescue them. Okay. So I don't really need to fight all these guys. Only only if they get in my way. All right. Oh, there he is. Gotta click on him. Uh-oh, this guy's coming over. Come on. Okay. Blasted rocks, yeah. Yeah, the dangers of working in a mine. Alright. Let's see. Where are we at? Are we... Yeah, we're down here. See, I knew it was down here. And Boar... What is it? Boar Court? Look at that. Alright. Alright. Oh, my God. 
Yeah, someone wants to tell me that if you're having difficulty in an area, it's all about the weapons and the armor and the level, basically. You know, if you're having difficulty, raise your, you know, raise your level, get better armor and better gear, basically. That's what it comes down to. Yep. And I'm just talking about landscape quests, you know. I mean, there's really not much mechanics dealing with landscape. Now, doing raids and instances and stuff, that's another story. That's where you really need to learn all, all your skills, what your skills do. Learn to remove corruptions, put a corruption on if your raid leader needs it and all that stuff. And, you know, um, what else? What else do you have to do? Um... Stun your enemies. Um, remove, uh, interrupt a skill. That's very important. You gotta know which of your skills interrupt a skill. And yeah, but that's it. But see, I don't, I don't raid and do all that much. And so, yeah, sometimes when I do, I they they tell me to do something. I'm like, what? I don't know what I'm doing, man. But anyway, and I'm like, what skill is that? Yeah, you know, because really on landscape, you only need a few skills. And that's it. And there's another... Another set of rocks right there. Alright. Alright. This might be it. Might be the last one. Fourteen. Fourteen rocks cleared. Ha 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 ha. Fifteen. Fifteen rocks cleared. Ha 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 ha. Sixteen. Sixteen rocks cleared. Ha 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 ha. Okay. Good. Regroup with the rescued Longbeards. Okay, let's see where he's going. Blasted rocks. That would suck as they were escaping that if I didn't clear out the the hobgoblins that they would come along and kill them like that guy. That guy. Okay, let's see where he's going. Wow, and here I thought they would just kind of like despawn, but no. They're actually going back to a rally point. I wonder if this ever bugged out. I guess not. Okay. Yeah, I can see some problems here where, uh, um, uh, as they're running back or whatever, something could bug and the mission would not complete and all that stuff. But okay, this one completed. So all right. We thank you, brave champion. Travel? No, we don't want to travel. Okay, we want to get our reward first. So I guess I could click on any one of these, yeah. Thank you, brave champion. Without your assistance, we would certainly be done for. I believe I speak for all of us when I say that we are ready to return to safer dwellings whenever you are. Okay. Talk to Prince Ingor. Maybe I should get on my new spiffy goat. There we go. I have heard of your success. Ah, the safe return of the long bearded explorers. Ah, you have returned, and like you said, I have heard of your success and the safe return of the long beard explorers. You have done well to strengthen the bond between all the dwarves in Gundabad. I believe we could do more, however. Let us send those explorers a gift to show that the Zoruka are just as pleased as any long beard at their safe return. Some ales, bread, and draughts should do nicely. We can present this package to the long beard emissary before he departs. Okay. Where do I collect this stuff? Alright, let's get on the goat. Maybe in the kitchen. The dining area. Down here. 
probably. Okay. Yeah. Well, no, I, I, you know what? I'm glad these quests are doing more to, that you become more of a guy that, eh, I guess it's not over here. I would think so. Ales, bread, and dross. Let's see what the quest says. Uh, yeah, I'm here. Wonderful. Now we gotta find it. All right. Apologize in advance if, uh, there's a dwarf explorer there. Apologize if, if in advance if I take too long on this. Because I don't know where they're at. I would think they'd be in the kitchen. Ales, bread, and draughts. Lord. Why would they not make it in the kitchen? I, I mean, I just don't understand that at all. Okay. Well, that's the king. Dwarf Explorer. Let's go upstairs. Let's go around here. I don't know why. That's over here. Don't see anything through there. Maybe it's up one more. There we go. All right, at the top. Okay, healing drop. Okay. Now, see, when I first read that, I thought they were talking about like a draught, like draft beer or something so I'm like I was kind of thinking well, you know why would you have them collect ales and draft beer but no it's just a healing draught the potions which makes sense all right Man, why did why did all my stuff move? Earlier, my inventory moved as well, and I wonder why. Uh, what's all this? It's all that. Well, let's just do a loot all. All right. Yeah, I gotta go back to the task board, do some more tasks, and maybe I should just max out my crafting. I should probably do that. Let's see. All right, where are we at? Okay, nothing over there, it looks like. I saw some, yeah, saw some over here. Of course I didn't get everything. Alright, where's my goat? Here we go. Where are you? Two more. Here we go. One more. Probably hiding behind a pole or something. Maybe on the other side over here. Okay. 
Man, go, you don't want, don't go on the table. There we go. Now let's pack up all the items into a care package. How do I do that? Oh, Lord. All right, there's probably some place where I have to do that at. I'm guessing. And I think my wife's calling me. I'll be back. Okay, we're back. All right, good. get that out of the way. All right. Okay. Uh, all right, let's see where we could get a... Put this into a care package. Okay. All the items into a care package. Maybe do that at a workbench or something? I don't know. Let me see. Let's see if Prince Ignor has something to say. What's over here? Empty crate. There we go. We must be doing the same quest. Okay. Come on, I am facing the target. Maybe I have to get off the goat. There we go. Co collect. Ah, oh, gee whiz. Really? Collect the care package. All right. To the visiting Longbeard Emissary. There we go. <clears throat> With a big sword over his head. Hi. Hi. Ah, thank you for this care package. I'm sure that the Longbeards you rescued will be honored to receive such a gift. My personal thanks for all that you have done, champion. Talk to Prince Ingor. <clears throat> You have done well. The care package has been delivered. Good, good. You have done well. Very. You have done well today, my friend. Okay, and is that finished? Oh, I guess so. So now we're on chapter five. Within the whole of no. Because I choose to ignore it. No. Okay, so we're going to end the video there for now. I have to go run an errand. So, but I'll be back. And we'll continue on with Chapter 5. So if you like the video, please feel free to hit that like, subscribe, bell notification. And if you're already a subscriber, thank you so much. Uh, I greatly appreciate it. All right. Thank you all. And see you all next time.